Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, Modest Transformation by Celeste. If you're new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button and join my transformation squad. Today I have got some amazing makeup hacks to get you looking flawless and classroom ready in no time. Let's dive in. First thing first is to apply face primer. I'm using Kiss uh, Face Primer Hydration Cool. I'm going to place one on my forehead and like on my cheeks, my left and right side as well. So I'm just going to squeeze some um, on my fingers and apply that face primer, which is very important. So you want your skin to be very smooth on your first day back to school. So you don't want to seem like you have on makeup. It's just your skin. So I'm going to also apply some um, gel eyebrow, eyebrow gel on my eyebrows. Um, I'm using a brunette color. So I'm going to also show you a second option. If you do not have eyebrow gel, just use some eyeshadow. Look, if you're on a run late for the bus or going to school or going to work, look, eyeshadow is your best friend. You can use it for anything, your eyebrows, your lips. Hey, you can make an eyeliner. It's your best friend. And I'm just using the spoolie. And you guys can see the difference from the eyebrow gel and the eyebrow um, eyeshadow palette. It doesn't matter how you do it. I want to show you guys both. If you do have eyebrow gel, you can use that. Or you don't, you can just use your eyeshadow palette. Now, I'm going to use my foundation on my sponge. Now, if you do not have a brush or you do not know how to draw out the concealer under your eye, I'm going to show you guys how to do this. So, you're just going to apply that sponge underneath your eyebrow you just be very careful take your time a little bit and if you do have a brush you can use an angle brush which helps clean the excess of your eyebrows helps shape your eyebrows as well so i have an angle brush i'm just going in in the creases to i want to make sure that i have a nice arch and I'm just going on top a little bit and I'm going like in the center of my nose because I want my eyebrows to be A1 when I wear my makeup. And that's the most second important thing is your eyebrows. Face primer, eyebrows, those are the top two that you should mostly, definitely should have done. So you guys see the difference? So I did the eyebrow gel. Now, I'm going to do the opposite side, which I have the eyeshadow as my eyebrow. And I'm applying it underneath my brow. So, you guys see, just take your time. You don't need a lot of concealer or foundation that you prefer to use to have an arch in your brows <clears throat> and have a clean um, brow look. That's what I usually call, or I usually call my Aaliyah brows. And I'm just applying, and then you guys see how clean it looks already so this technique is very easy for beginners like if you don't know how to line up your brows all you have to do is follow the shape of your brow underneath and then blend it in now the third hack is if you do not have concealer nor foundation well mostly concealer or the base um, for your eyeshadow, just use Vaseline. Vaseline is your best friend as well. And I'm just going to use a new color. I'm not using no loud color for back to school. All you have to do is look very natural. I'm just applying some nude eyeshadow on. And you see how natural it looks. And it stays on with the Vaseline. So if you're in a hurry... This is one of the best uh, makeup hacks that I have ever done. Especially if you're running late to school, you don't have um, a primer or concealer or a base. Use Vaseline and apply some eyeshadow with your finger and just go. And that is it. I mean, it's very simple. You don't have to try to do too much. And it's just very easy. It'll take you about two minutes. 
on the go. Now, this is a tint moisturizer. I'm using the foundation too. The tint moisturizer is the warm coconut and then the foundation is the classic tin. So I'm going to apply both colors on my cheek and I'm going to show you guys how it looks. So you guys have both where you have either or. I'm going to show you guys this easy technique for you guys. So now I'm going to blend in those two colors. I didn't, I didn't place a lot on my cheek. I'm just spreading it out as you guys see under my eyes and my cheekbones. And I'm going to work my way up towards my forehead as well. And as you guys see that the concealer, the tint moisturizer have a shine to it. So if you don't want to shine, I'm going to show you guys directly how to do it. So it looks just like your skin. And there's no worries if you do have a shine in your foundation. It's fine. Or concealer. I'm going to use my under eye. Um, it's really like setting uh, powder. And you guys see I'm just applying with my finger. Usually I do it for brush by like doing it with my fingers. And I'm using my um, triangle sponge. Which helps like absorbs the oil so I'm just going to blend that in so I don't want my skin to look funny or know that I have on makeup so I want it to look natural as possible and I'm just going to go under the eye and you guys see how natural my skin looks now with that concealer and foundation mix now the next hack is to use your eyeshadow if you don't have blush like I said once before, eyeshadow is your best friend. I'm going to use this reddish brown color. I'm going to apply that on my cheeks with my finger. I'm just applying it in a circular motion. And I'm going to do that same technique on both sides of my face. And I'm going to use that dark brown like a contour. I'm placing two little dots underneath that blush. And all I'm going to do is blend that out. I'm just going in a circular motion. Circle, 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 probably about two or three times. And as you guys see, it looks very natural using eyeshadow. Now for your lips, you can use lip balm. Now I'm just using the color plum. You can use a different color of your choice. Um, I just love the color. Now I'm just going in with a nude color. And I'm just going to apply it on my lips. Because I kind of want it like a, a shimmer but like a different gloss and that is it this is the final look i hope you guys did enjoy and that's it your quick and easy back to school makeup routine these hacks was have you out the door in no time looking flawless for the classroom or for work if you found these tips helpful please give this video a thumbs up and let me know in the comments what is your go-to makeup hack is and of course don't forget to subscribe for more beauty tips hacks and transformation. Thank you for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.